you know, I'm getting ready to leave here, but God, it's just so nice out. And it's just, I love this property. I this Airbnb that I'm staying at. I just had to make another video, you know. And um, I was going through my emails this morning and I was searching for something that I needed to find. And I found a, a letter, uh, an email letter. That's hilarious, a letter. I, I, I uh, came across this email that I got from... Um, somebody and it said thank you so much for uh, recommending ethereum I made almost a million dollars I bought a house I bought this really nice car da da da, da you know and um, he sent me a picture uh, with champagne bottles and cigar and, um, and no I mean you know I'm well first of all I didn't recommend Ethereum. I just told people, uh, you know, that I really thought it was going to change the world and this and that. And, and that's not a recommend recommendation. That's just me telling my story about it. So, uh, no, I don't recommend things. I didn't recommend that to anybody. Um, I just said, go do your own due diligence. So that guy must have went out, did his own due diligence, listened to a hundred or a thousand people, made and he made a decision for himself. Said, hey, yeah, I think that's good, you know. But here's, you know, I'm not, I'm not going to name names, obviously, you know, or put up a picture of this guy. I, I mean, I'm stoked that he's doing good. But, um, see, for me, I guess maybe why I'm doing so good is I don't go out and buy cars. I don't go out and buy houses. You know what I mean? Like, he... He had a million dollars, close to a million dollars, so he couldn't resist the urge to go buy stuff. And I get that, you know what I mean? But if you're a true investor, you know what I mean? You would maybe, you know what I mean? Like, because I even asked him, I wrote him back and I said, did you like put a down payment on these things or did you just outright buy them? He's like, he's like, bro, I'm rich. I just, I just bought them with cash. And I was like, I mean, I didn't respond, but I'm just saying like, that's, that's not what I would do. And I'm not wrecking, you can do whatever you want. I'm just saying personally, telling my experience, you know what I mean? Every time that uh, I make a million dollars, I don't go buy stuff with it. Yeah, maybe a few things, but not even a hundred thousand dollars worth of shit. Not even like maybe 50, you know what I mean? Um, but what I do is I put the rest of that money back into um, as many investments that I like. And there's so many cryptocurrencies going on. There's so many ICOs going on that, I mean, you can't even see it on my screen right now, but I just sold something on eBay. You know what I mean? That's an investment. Oh, you probably heard it right there, huh? On my phone, you know? Bam, you've received money. <laughs> you know what I mean? Um, and so, yeah, I invest large. I invest small. I, You know what I mean? If I if I make a $20 investment, you know, I don't sell it till it's 40 You know what I mean? Just like that just happened on my phone. I, I paid like 19 bucks for that. And uh, sold it for, I don't know what, I didn't even look, 40, 44, something like that. I mean, I just make up numbers when I sell shit. I'm like, ah, <laughs> you know. Um, but yeah, that's kind of what I'm getting at is, I don't know if this guy realizes this, but if he would have took that million dollars and invested it into multiple different, he was to put his egg into multiple different baskets, he'd probably become a multi-millionaire. And... I hate to tell him this, but he's going to have a really, really hard time maintaining being a millionaire if you if he's just out there buying clothes. And I mean, um, well, I shouldn't say clothes, but I was just in his picture. He had like, he was dressed to the T. He looked like, you know, what I mean, he, he, he really wanted to res represent to everybody that saw him that he was like this rich guy now. And that's that's fine. Do what you want. It's a free world. It's a free country. That's that's what makes everything great. But I'm just trying to say, like, me personally, every time I make a million dollars, I maybe, maybe spend like 10% of that on myself. I spend the 90, 95% of it on real, true wealth, on, on investments, precious metals, Bitcoin, Ethereum, Litecoin, Steam it, Waves, you know what I mean? Like, just, just and I'm not, I'm not even, I'm not saying... I shouldn't even mention the things that I invest in, but I did, and I can't undo it. But, but I have thousands of them, literally thousands of them. So, um, you know, I mean, that's why I don't recommend anything, is because 
you know, one person might say, oh, well, you, you know, I put my life savings into that. What, you fucking idiot? You fucking idiot? Like, how many times, have you ever watched American Greed? There's a TV show called American Greed. And if you haven't seen it, go to Hulu and watch it because you will learn every single time these people put their life savings into this investment and then they lost everything. Well, that's what happens when you, even if you were to put your entire life savings into one investment, you're gonna be so stressed out when it goes down or, or whatever, you know? So, yeah. Um, and so I kind of think of the same thing. If you go out and buy a house with cash, like this guy claimed he did, then, I mean, I guess good for you. You don't have you don't have a, a mortgage payment every month. So, you know, I mean, obviously his life is better than it was, but I'm just saying, if he would have invested that money into 10 or 100 different things, after those things paid off, he could have gone and bought in 10 houses or 100 houses or whatever it is, you know? So, um... I know I um, people tell me in the comments that I use too many zeros like when I talk about investment I say oh well you know if you were to invest ten thousand dollars into this da 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 you know what I mean and people are like oh well, I don't have ten thousand dollars well I'm just trying to use a round number you know what I mean and to be honest like when I invest into something I put a lot more than ten thousand dollars into it <laughs> you know what I mean so I'm trying to mentally think of a lower number um, but, but when I say a thousand, it just doesn't, I mean, even when you, even when you make like 10 times your investment on a thousand bucks, you're, you're getting $10,000, you know what I mean? So for me, it's like, that isn't, I don't know. That's not very cool. I mean, it's, it's, it's cool for somebody who doesn't know yet, but for somebody who knows that, you know what I mean? That you can make a lot, 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 lot more than, you know, there's a big difference. So anyway, um, I just wanted to make this short video because um, I ran across that email and it made me like realize that I don't think I've made a video yet on um, what you can do with money. Money is the most versatile thing. So when you give it up and you don't put a, a down payment on that house and you just go buy that car outright, that money is you can no longer use for investments. And so, I mean, if you want to work for your rest of your life, Keep spending your investments on stuff. If you want to retire, travel the world, and really just appreciate and uh, be thankful for life, then keep investing your money. Like keep the snowball going. If you listen to my other videos, I call it an investment snowball because the snowball just keeps getting bigger. It starts really small. It doesn't matter if it's a hundred dollar investment or a thousand dollar investment, ten thousand, hundred thousand, million, two million, a hundred million. 10 million, whatever it is, you know what I mean? That you're, whatever level that you're at, try to think of your level as how many zeros you're playing with. And and don't get me wrong, don't, don't say, okay, I need to put all my zeros in this one thing. No, that's putting all your eggs in one basket. That's probably the, the worst recommendation ever. So I do not recommend that. What I'm saying is, is diversify, not into a, a world diversified portfolio, you know, that shit just is like, you know, do your research and find different investments that you can, you know, learn about, you know, and uh, your life can get better, you know. So, anyway, um, that's all I really had to say, you know, I mean, just uh, just realize that with every dollar or ten dollars or a hundred dollars, a thousand or ten thousand, you have the option to do whatever you want with it, you know, and if you're going to go blow it on stuff don't be surprised that you're gonna have to work hard and even if you've already learned that if you invest in you can make money with money you can invest why, why spend most of your money on something that ties you down on something that you can't keep doing um that thing successfully again you know what i mean um so i hope that uh there was some bit of information that at least one person out there um, found helpful and so, um, with that being said, I hope you guys have a great day, and I hope that this is the best day of your life, because you're alive. Peace.